YouTube welcome back to my channel today's video is going to be a review slash swatch video of the makeup revolution maxi reloaded palette I have it in large it up which is the neutral version of these palettes these palette this palette comes in four other color combinations for lack of a better word and at Ulta it comes in two I believe the other two you have to buy from MakeupRevolution.com. So they have it at Ulta in the Big Big Love, which is the like mostly reds and pinks. And then they have it in this one, Large It Up. Um, but I am going to do some swatches, sort of a review of this palette. And when I first saw this palette, I think what drew me to it is that it looked like it was an extension of another palette that I had from Makeup Revolution. And it, that is the Velvet Rose palette. This looks like, to me, the big brother of the Velvet Rose palette. It kind of almost looks like you have some, some duplicates, but then when you look at it again, it does not really. These have their own individual shades, and these are like a dupe for the soft glam palette and then this is an extension of this palette right here you do have some kind of dupes the black looks like a duplicate when i look at this palette though um i thought at first that the the shadows looked like they were smaller so they can get more of them in there but they are they are slightly smaller but instead of being like turned east west in like this palette they are sort of north south in this palette so you can get more of them in there i have heard in other videos that the quality of this maxi reloaded palette was a little bit better than the quality in the reloaded palettes and the reloaded palette quality is pretty good now when i used it Myself, I couldn't really tell the difference that if, if it was any better than the one that I already know about and have been using. The only thing that kind of is a drawback to me is that this one, the smaller one, seems to have more crease colors that I would use like sort of transition wise than this one does. This one has like one sort of transition color where I feel like this one, I can use this one, I can use that one, I can probably use this one. Like I can use any of the mattes in my crease. These have mattes in them but the mattes are a little bit darker. Like I can use this one in my crease as a transition this one on camera looks like it might be okay, but in person it looks a little dark. This one is a little dark. This one is definitely like outer V right here. Um, but other than that, I think this palette is gorgeous. I think this palette would be perfect for like everyday use. I think this palette would be good if you just want to pop a gold eyeshadow on your lid because you know I like a good gold eyeshadow. If you want to just pop a good gold eyeshadow on your lid and be done for the day i think this palette is great for that the palette i didn't say is 18 dollars, and you get how many shades you get 45 shades for 18 dollars, and i think these are 45 shades that you would probably use each and every one of them so that makes it even a better value so i am going to get in to swatching some of the shadows I am not going to be doing a shadow a swatch of all 45 I'm going to be doing a, a swatch of like a good representation of the shadows you know I'm going to swatch this black one so I might as well get it out of the way first this one with all this sparkle in it that I hope is not an overspray um it kind of does look like it's an overspray and this is what it looks like it looks like once you get past that top you won't get all of this glitter in it and it, it's, it's okay 
it's okay. I just don't think it's going to deliver all of that wow that it looks like in the pan. Like when I lift it up now, actually still there's a lot of glitter in there. So here's hoping. Here's hoping you can get down. Let me do another swatch of it. That you can get down to the bottom of it and it still has a lot of glitter in it. So these are the two swatches side by side. All right. And I just kind of stuck my finger in one. I am going to, of course, you know, swatch this gold color right here in the middle. Sort of in the middle. But that is the one that draws my eye right to it. So I am going to swatch that one. And I think I've worn that one a couple of times. It's not, it's more of a bronzy gold than it is a straight up gold. But that is what that looks like. That is gorgeous. I am going to swatch this champagne color here. Because it kind of, kind of puts me in the mind the way it looks formulated. That is like that gold one. And it kind of is. They are not like a creamy consistency. They are, they feel sort of silky and they glide right on, which I really, really like a lot. Um, let's do, let's do this shade right here. That's pretty also. So far so good with the pigmentation. I want to keep going down my arm. I am going to swatch one that the formula looks a little bit different on. Let's go here with this shade here. Okay, still pretty. My watch is completely in the way. Still pretty. This shade right here. Uh, let's do a matte and I am going to go with this shade right here, which I feel like I have used on my eyes already. And that's right there. That's gorgeous. I am going to swatch. Let's go with this. This looks like, um, sort of an antique gold right here. And I'll swatch that. Wow. This one has more of that creamy consistency to it. And I'm going the wrong way on my arm. But it is, boom, right there. I am going to go with this shade here. The one I said makes a pretty decent transition shade. And I have used it for that. And that is that right there. That shade right there. This palette actually is pretty good. Like, I, I really want that colorful one, but I bought the, that new, the sort of new Makeup Revolution, the Tammy Revolution one. So I won't um, buy another colorful one. Uh, let's do what I would use on my brow bone. That's this one down here. It's sort of a cream color feels very, let's see, very soft, and that's pretty nice. My swatch is horrible, and it's in a horrible spot, but that one is pretty good. I like that one. I am going to do this one. This one catches my eye also. I don't want to call it a rose gold because it looks a little bit darker than that. And this one has that more creamy metallic, wow, consistency. Let's watch a dark brown. And that's right here. That's pretty good. I won't even swatch that one twice. That's, let's watch that one. That one is pretty good. And as you can see, it can be built up. I am liking this palette more and more. Um, let's see what else catches my eye here. Let's swatch. I don't think I swatched this one. Did I swatch this one? I don't think so. Let's swatch 
that one right there. Gorgeous. And it's swatched right on with no problem at all. And I am going to... Uh, let's watch this one over here in this corner right here. That's kind of interesting to me. Very pretty. And if I can show you, it is, it's very pretty. So that is it, you all. I would absolutely say this palette is worth the $18. Of course, you know with um, picking it up from Ulta, you can always get that $350 off of $10. Makeup Revolution is always on sale. So you might be able to catch this one on sale also. Um, the other one has a lot of reds and pinks and it reminds me of the, the uh, Reloaded palette. This has called Red Alert, really pretty. Um, that's it you all the quality you can see on my arm the, the shadows are gorgeous the shadows are pigmented i think you pretty much get a really good bang for your buck if you pick this palette up if you also want to pick this one up you can pick this one up to go in to uh, into like a what am i trying to say to go as like an extension of the to the other palette Lord have mercy, I jumbled that one up. What I do want to do while I'm on these two palettes, I want to swatch the two blacks. So this one that I'm going to swatch first is from the regular Reloaded palette. Uh, and I'll just swatch it right here. This black is amazing. That black is amazing. Now this one I'm going to swatch is from the Maxi Reloaded palette. And we'll see. Yeah, I think these are the same black. This black is amazing. I feel like I heard somebody say before, show me your black and I can tell you how good your palette is. This is a gorgeous black. Some high-end palettes don't have a black this black and this nice. That's it, you all. Go pick it up. That's all I'm saying. Go pick the palette up. You won't feel like you wasted your money at all. 45 shades, $18. Pigmentation is amazing. And pick that one up too while you add it. Seven dollars, under thirty dollars, and you can get two palettes with a whole bunch of shades in it. So you got fifteen and forty-five. Do the math, because I can't do the math. But I say pick it up. I like this palette. That's it, you all. Thank you all so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed it, please give it a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. If you are already subscribed to my channel, please make sure you hit that notification bell so you know when I have a new video coming out. Have a great day and may your day be as flawless as your makeup. Bye.